CBS 6 Sky Tracker is sponsored by RCI Builders. Bundle up. Even though it's clear outside, it is definitely cold. Current temperature 34 degrees. Winds are out of the west to about three miles per hour, but they will continue to pick up throughout the day. And notice anything else? Yeah, the dew point in the teens. So you'll notice you might be drinking a little extra water today, or your hair could be a little more staticky because we are lacking moisture across central Virginia. Now, when it comes to the upper levels, we do have just a few clouds, particularly over into the northern neck and pushing into northern Virginia. And yes, that is some snow in the upper level activity, but then you take away that and you'll notice not seeing too much of the way of snowfall to the surface just on the radar. However, I would not be surprised if the northern neck did receive a snow flurry or two. Not a big deal, just a flurry or two. And if it does head down well, it's definitely going to stick to some locations because we are below freezing. You're coming in 29 in Tappahannock, 34 in Kilmarnock, over into the city at 34 degrees as well, 25 in the Tri-Cities. I'll be there this afternoon. I can guarantee you I'm going to be bundled up. 35 over to Charlottesville, 27 in Stanton. Now your current winds around 5 to 15 miles per hour, but as the day progresses, these winds will continue to go up. So of course there will be a chill factor this morning as well as the afternoon hours. And that chill factor is rather abrupt in the tri cities. It feels as if y'all are coming in at 19 degrees, 28 is what it feels like in West Point, 27 in Louisa. And you know the winds fluctuate going up and down just a bit. So of course, so will these feel like temperatures or wind chills. So just be aware. Now the winds will be breezy throughout today. Overnight, we're going to see them calm down significantly and your temperatures are going to head down as well. You're actually going to wake up with numbers in the 20s and those light winds stay with us throughout the entire day on Friday. So today, plenty of sunshine. Definitely need those sunglasses, but you probably need your gloves too. Overnight, a few clouds are going to push through as we go into Friday. By Friday afternoon, a mixture of sun and clouds. And then Saturday for the first part of the day, just incredibly sunny. But then clouds will be on the increase, filtering in from our southwest to the northeast. It may look like it's going to rain at times. You could see a little bit of a raindrop or two, but not anything significant. Just some cloudy skies easing in. But look at these temperatures. 48 degrees today, 26 tomorrow morning, and then we'll be in the 50s. And look at this. The 60s make a return Saturday as well as Sunday. We're flirting with 70 degrees and Monday, and we continue to stay nice and warm all the way into Wednesday of next week. Kristen, can we just say hello, spring? But you know what? Don't